Hi there, welcome to my channel. In this video, we'll examine the Xiaomi Ninja G1 Robot Vacuum Cleaner. This one is sold for around 160 US dollars. The best price I found was 156 and from Czech Warehouse, so I got it in like four days. I ordered on Monday and on Friday it was delivered to my door. Pretty nice, concerning that we're all used to delivering time of more than a month from China. Now let's see what we get with this robot. First of all, the robot itself. Then there's a docking station with a power adapter. Since this robot has the mopping function, you also get the module for wet cleaning with one microfiber cloth. Then there is a small brush tool for cleaning the robot and instruction manual in Chinese. The design of Mija Sweeping Robo G1 resembles the design of the Mija 1C model. The same snow white body with a simple flat lid and semicircular bumper. The only difference is the lack of video camera on the front panel. There are still two control buttons, auto start and return to base. The built-in lithium-ion battery with a capacity of 2500 milliampere hours last between 60 and 90 minutes of operation depending on the mode. G1 should manage to clean up to 100 square meters of the which it is sent to recharge. Even though there is no laser or camera guidance on this one, it has gyroscope and odometers infrared sensors, pumple rail and fall sensors, so it is able to orientate pretty well in the room. One useful thing is that there is an opening under the docking station where you can store the excess cable. There is a small band on its edge to open the cover more easy. Under the lid we find a Wi-Fi indicator, a reset button and a compartment into which a 2-in-1 dust collector and water reservoir goes. HEPA filter is inserted into the back wall of the dust container. The suction power of the NIDEC brushless motor is 2200 PA. The debris is kept in the main compartment of the 600 ml dust collector which also has room for 200 ml water. Now let's see the installation in Mi Home. First of all, run Mi Home and then turn on the robot. Mi Home should find it automatically. When you select the robot, it should ask you for a password to your Wi-Fi and that's it. From there on, it should all be automatic. As with all media devices, you will get a chance to rename the device to your liking and assign it to a room.
operation is pretty simple. You choose the suction power between quiet, standard, medium and turbo and if mopping, set the amount of water. And that's it. Press the play button and it will start cleaning. Even though this is a basic model, it can work fairly well. In my opinion, it is ideal for a home with a higher threshold so robots can go over them to another room. The G1 should cross over obstacles up to 1.7 cm in height. Another advantage is that it is only 82 mm mild, which is lower than most advanced robots which have camera and laser guidance, so it should get easily under furniture. If you don't care about no-go zones and other more advanced features, this is ideal robot for you. You just put it in the room, press start button and it will clean. To activate the web wiping mode, it is enough to pour the water into a reservoir of the dust collector and attach the module for wet cleaning with microfiber cloth under the robot. After that, the robot will not only vacuum the floor but also wipe it with a damp cloth. After the mopping, the clothes can be removed and washed with soap to be reused. Thanks for watching, and if you like my channel, please subscribe.